Hey guys, Sarge Death again. That didn't go well. So I spent a lot of time after Champ Sol uh, after that game talking with that that vein. And mentality plays a huge huge you know, I'm gonna have to try to pop this one I w I wanna make this get this very good. Mentality plays a tremendous part in how you play League. If you come into the game expecting to lose, expecting to not do well, uh, believing it's a difficult lane, it will be a difficult lane. You won't do well. You're going to lose. If you come in believing you can do this, you just have to play well. Know where the enemy's strengths are, know where their weaknesses are, and continually think about where their problems are and what you can do to better them. Or better yourself against it to attack those weak points. You don't always, always, always think, you, or let me rephrase this, you should never 100% believe that this game's over, that a game's over, until, well, no cure you have, fools. I, I, you know what, I'm actually going to take that statement back, it's, yeah, you, you absolutely can, it's just very dependent on things, there are games where it looks like it's going to be over, and you know, you guys pull a miracle out of your ass. It does happen. No, I've done it do before in my. I've had it before in my games. It's not super common, but it's a thing that can happen. You always need to be looking for those spots where you can take something. You can get some kind of an advantage. I firmly believe. That as long as you're trying the entire game, and you don't let your emotions run wild, you think you can come back from it, and you play well, even if you lose, that game was not a lost game. Even if, if it's especially if it's a very close game, then it's not a lost game. You did technically lose. Yes. But I, I think that every game needs to be taken as a learning experience. There's always something that can be done better in each game. Figure out where you screwed up. Figure out what you can do better. Since you're the only point that you can consistently rely on. You're the only thing that's consistent across games. Apparently I'm going. See, and that's the thing, right? I'm thinking about this even in Champion Select and looking at my team. What do I need to do? I need to basically go full damage. Or full tank. I can't really afford to go damaging. I also need to, before I forget. Uh, actually, Gretchen, make sure I've got the right masteries. Like I said, my runes probably need to be changed. And I, I absolutely know that. Um, I, they're, they're old. Uh, cancel. No, I don't want to save. Jungle. Okay. That's right, I was playing here last. I love War and King Um, uh, Dynasty Wars is a tremendous series. So I, I get to be full tank, so I'm not going to be... I'm actually probably... And this is going to feel weird, because I don't normally do it, and it's normally not a great idea, but I think I might actually even go the, uh... The tanking thing. The thing with Vi is that a lot of her util utility it comes through. Uh, a lot of her utility comes in through doing things. Uh, oh, that's open on that. Okay, that's interesting. I think that so much of this game can be won just by thinking you can do it and knowing where the enemy's strengths and weaknesses are. Because I didn't pay full attention during Champion Select, I didn't see what their last pick was for top. So I don't know if they're going to have a tank or not either. They may go full damage. 
which means that I'm actually really good here. Uh, drafting team comps is something that I, I think really needs to be. I think if anything we could do, we could afford to put voice chat just in in champion select. And as so he's going to go tank. So I can afford to go. I can afford to go full tank. So you're going to have more physical damage than magical damage. Um, I don't need to be doing lots of damage because I've got, you know, these guys. <laughs> I, I mean, I also have a Soraka. So it's, I mean, it's not like I'm doing. Oh no, it's right, it's Lux. So we're good on the damage front. We've got two physical damage dealers, two magic damage dealers, and I'm just gonna go tanky. And the way I play Vi, and especially I think the way she needs to be, play, be played right now in the jungle, is that uh, you need you, you're mostly there for your CC, for the knockback on your Q, as well as the uh, knock up on the ult. Yes, the damage is nice. It's not really going to be my main concern. I think I may end up going the red trinket or the red jungle item, and then just full tank from that. Normally, I'll buy. Actually, normally that's what I do. But how quickly I'll need to shift into that? Let's see. That's that's going to be what the question is. I'm also actually going to turn up Castlevania music a little. Actually, no, I'm going to turn down the in-game audio for everything here. So I think, I think especially last game, it was really loud. So currently, and, and this is just, this is anecdotal, and I don't know how accurate it is. OPGG shows that I my MMR is higher than what it should be. So. Yeah, they've got a very damaging team. I forget you can drag that, and I didn't want to be. Plan? I don't need a plan. Uh, that's also no. I want to look at that. Health and bonus health. Welcome to Rift. For some attack damage and cooldown. I need some attack damage, I think. You know, I come in every. I, I try and I isolate every game as its own thing. Oh no, that tickle! If you hit a wall, hit it hard. I'm gonna go red to there. Let's I'm gonna need the assistance here. I'm gonna save smite so I can go for that for their blue. Aurelian, it would have been really nice if you could have helped out. We're gonna go in. Uh, so that I'll have a four ten's the magic number. So all it was was <laughs> all it was was the trade jungles. I'm 
I'm not exactly in the spot I'd want to be. But I'm not in the worst spot. Yeah, only the third one gets over the wall. Free or don't. I don't care. Flash down, I can be more productive in future games. Um, Riven's gonna have a hard time against them. Sometimes you gotta make a door. Apparently, I missed that last one, which is a little interesting. Here I come to save the day. Or wreck it. This gives me a way, but at least allow me, yeah. mind. I won't gank. I'll just continue jungling. Yeah, no, you guys can't fight this. You guys need it back. That's not good. <laughs> oh, Aurelian! Follow! You're on such a high mobility champion! should not be able to outroam you on your fucking Aurelian soul. That's problematic. I mean, we're not gonna get anything done. They're gonna back off. We just need to get the fucking blue. No! Get the fucking hell! I don't have the capability of ganking right now. I need the fucking experience. I'm not... No. They're warding. My, laner, my laners aren't, because the fucking Lux refuses to go back. The Raelian does not want... No, no, too late. Now, now you can come and get it. Let's get cracking. I'm doing this my way.
The other game is turning off. I, I fucking... I, I just vehemently disagree with everything this Aurelian Soul is doing right now. He is not doing things well. And this is coming from somebody that played Aurelian Soul earlier and got his ass handed to him against Nari. But I don't play Aurelian Soul. This guy's a fucking Mastery 7. Which means he plays Aurelian Soul. Which means he knows the champion. You know, I have no problems with Flux getting the kill. I'd rather have Lux carry this game than Cerulean Soul. I just don't know what he's doing. I don't know why he's doing what he's doing. That's how you roam. That's how you gank. I don't like it when Here I come to save the day. junglers completely ignore a lane. When I'm that lane, I don't want to be that guy that does the ex does that thing he said not to do. Naz is getting shut down is not a really that big of an advantage because it's it's an Naz. He's going to scale up. And Sadie, I think you should be at one lane. Yeah, I don't know why you ulted. You 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 were better off just running. The reason I keep advocating we should be going for the dragon. That's not what I said to him. Oh my god. Whatever. So, I mean, we're doing pretty good. Overall. Why is my team fighting? Okay. If you hit a wall, hit it hard.
Leave time. Yeah. She went too hard for that kill. Five seventy. I don't waste time with my smites. I also don't like taking blues as jungler. I hear that and I keep thinking that's something in game. Let's get <laughs> that was not worth everything we expect that was used. Good job, Zai. Alright, let's finish Boots off. Let's get some... Uh, yeah, let's get some armor. I think their biggest damage there. The real threats right now are their physical damage threats. Uh, we'll finish this and then we'll go with a uh, strong mount. Malmorcious. I think that would be a good item to get for magic resistance. Riven's so far ahead, she can get this kill. And then. Hundred. Didn't even need to smite it. We really didn't, just because we had so much damage. Plasma is smite on other things. Oh, that's right, I, I thought I died uh, in that fight for some reason. Was that damn good? I didn't die. Uh, note to self, not actually that good. This is suicide. Yeah. You were in far too deep. And we're unwilling to, to do anything about it. Zaya is just pushing mid and not really giving a fuck. Because she has no mana. So I'm responsible for defending mid rig now. Yeah, go for me. Okay, you, if, if you'd landed that ult lux, we'd be fine. Wow, that was terrible. Also, Aurelian Soul really needed to just come straight from bot up instead of going back.
This is definitely a game for the the adaptive film. I think actually, both Sona and Syndra do very consistent damp magic damage, which that's supposed to be designed to deal with. Another cloud. If you hit a wall, hit it hard. Guys, where, what the, what, where the, why the, what are you fucking, why, Riven, Riven, Riven. Can't believe Dragon's actually still up. We could always 5v5. That surprised me. I figured he was gonna run.
There we go. I'm wondering if I should get the adapter come first. I think that's probably what I'm gonna have to do. Fucking bird blocking. Yeah, I think the adaptive helm is probably the better uh, pick right away. Just based on uh, where their damage is. It's not really a whole lot of physical damage right now. Yeah, that's this is silly right now. She, the fact that she's continuing means she's got backup either there or on the Never way. I mean, I can get my life back. That's not a huge. Cinder's missing. I don't know where she went. I'm doing this my way. You really don't need the flash to get the kill. If you hit a wall, hit it hard. Yeah, that's what I'm getting now. So we have like no words anywhere in there. Nothing absolutely in their bottom. I'm doing this. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Um, what just happened? I took lots of physical damage. Demons play. And then the gargoyle stone played it. I don't need the damage, I need the tank.
She wasn't even in that fight. You'll never know what hit him. This one has a little spark. Linear Wombo. Plan? I don't need a plan. That's not what I'm getting next. I should, I should probably have that one highlighted. Let's get to the fun part. I think we'd be pushing it if we tried to go for it now. Kha'Zix is back up and the rest of the team's up. Syndra's are still up. Uh, never mind. Sindra is now dead. They did. So. I know I said stone plate. I think I, I do think I do need to get gargoyle. Stone plate. Since I'm gonna I, I'm the tank. Here I come to save the day. <sighs> I don't actually build any damage. I'm doing this. I mean, he's pretty much free killing. So taking him is not killing him is not. If you hit a wall, hit it hard. I haven't used my ult in a while. It feels weird. We do not have enough words on this map. The Aurelian song is places. Sometimes you gotta make a door. Expanding
Nope, I walked too far forward. Yeah. I think all my deaths are from when my I'm expecting my team to be there and be helping. That's okay, this guard will still glitch. That's not great. You need to watch your man. See, I'm of the opinion that we shouldn't even be trying here. I'm 
doing this for my life. Not showing them any respect to the Kazakhs. Throwing. Let's get to the fight. We're, we're throwing pretty good right now. Also, I think at this point, uh, our presentation. Vi stands for vice. Like, I kept them focused on me. What are you guys doing? Now, that's what you fuckers get for focusing on me. The secret is just play jungle for me. I mean, Riven did on more than one occasion as well, so I mean, uh, surprisingly, not. Oh, holy shit. Okay, so here's kind of the situation that I was in. You look at it, it's like, oh, Vayne and Ari are higher. Oh. Yeah, well, that's that's the second game. At least that's a fucking win. <laughs>